Tunnels being clear. I told you what would happen if you fired your weapon. What was I supposed to do? Throw rocks at him? I'm supposed to do is useless. Fucking listen to me. Next time, try this. Whatever. You're welcome. For what? For saving your ass. If you hadn't run off, my ass wouldn't need it saving. <laughs> Are you ready to fucking finish this? Yeah, I'm ready. This way. So, the bros off. Daddy said it looked like someone tried to burn his tax off. There's the rippers, wasn't it? You got a point, Schizo? I had a drifter coming. Word's gone out. Rippers are looking for two men. Mongols? Sound like anyone you know? Well, as you can see, I'm still wearing the cut. We're not hiding, Schizo. Carlos wants Boozer. He won't have any trouble finding him, but he's gonna have to go through me first. What'd you do to him? Gotta be something long before breaking the tree. Long before I... You know what? I don't know and I don't care. Have I killed a few rippers in my day? You're goddamn right I have, and after what they did to Boozer, I'm gonna go right on killing the crazy sons of bitches. Yeah, and Carlos is crazier than any of them. You don't want to be on his shit list, bro. What'd I just say? I don't care, and I'm not your bro. Remember what I told Iron Mike? Carlos can go fuck himself. Hey, just looking out for you. You're one of us now, right? Yeah, yeah, right. Don't worry about me and Boozer. We can look out for ourselves. This ought to make the old man happy. Shit's heavy. What are you talking about? You know the old man. Same with me. I got this. Thanks. He thinks that his treaty with the Rippers is gonna keep us safe. The thing is, they don't give a shit about any treaty. The only reason they haven't come down here in force is because they're too busy up north, hitting Copeland, the hot springs. Yeah, I know, I was there. So you know what I'm talking about. The Rippers are coming. And Iron Mike, he's just gonna let it happen. He's gonna let those bald-headed freak-alikes wash over us like a goddamn red tie. Excuse so you don't know that. So glad to see the light of day. Shit, something else we agree on. That's twice in one day. Hold up for a second. There's someone out there. Hey, what? Someone's inside. Hey, what's riding out there? Sit in your 
I think that's all the bastards. Yeah. <laughs> Come on. We gotta get that box of dynamite. Must have been the same assholes who parted out the bikes. Ride by and they see ours. They figured they'd make an easy score. I guess it wasn't as easy as they'd hoped. <laughs> you know, I hate to say it, but we actually make a good team, you and I. Then don't say it. Hey, there's something I gotta say. When you and Boozer rolled into camp and Iron Mike welcomed you back again with goddamn open arms, I thought it was another sign the old man was losing it. Going soft. Okay, what's your point, Scott? Hey, my point is that you and me, we see eye to eye. I get that now. You know, same as me. If Iron Mike don't wake the hell up, the camp's not gonna last another six months. Okay, still waiting for your point. Look, I know I've been busting you balls. We both know that. But a lot of people know what you've done. For your friend. How you been doing shit for the camp. Changes are coming, brother. When Iron Mike retires, let's call it, I say you and me, we step up and run the camp together. You and me. Run the camp. <laughs> That's really what you wanted to talk hey, to me about. Hey, hear me out, goddammit. <laughs> Just listen to me a minute. Uh -huh. Look, I got a lot of friends on the camp council, and they agree. Most of them say the old man's gotta go. Yeah, it's bullshit because Ricky would never go for She's as soft as and the old Mike man. And Mike trusts you. you. Well, that's his mistake. One of many. Oh, it ain't gonna be mine. Look, we all do things to survive, Schizo. I get that. You remember how I said there's some lines I ain't crossed? Stabbing a friend in the back? That's one of them. Better one old man than the entire camp. You think about that. Lake Camp, come in. Deacon St. John to Iron Mike. Deke, you and Schizo, you <laughs> Shit, perfect time. We got him. Schizo's on his way back with everything that we found. Listen, Mike, I gotta tell you. Yeah, Mike, uh, we got him. Schizo's on his way back with everything that we found. Listen, Mike, I gotta tell you. That's great. That's great. Now, we can't use him till we find some dead cord. You know that, right? I'll take a look through the files we got. Mike, listen to me. Schizo, he's on me. Jesus, what now? You boys try and shoot your damn heads off again? No, Mike, but he, uh... He wants to run the camp, Mike. He told me him... him oh, <laughs> hell, I know all about that. Remember, I told you already. 
Schizo thinks I'm a pacifist and I'm gonna get us all killed. I know he's been talking. Mike! Deke, like I said, Schizo's got his issues, but it... That should do. <sighs> it, it's not like we don't got ours. Thanks for your concern, but I can take care of myself. Mike, out. Uh, Jesus. You always do. Gotcha, you son of a bitch. No more Amish characters for you, huh? Loser, you there? Yeah, dude. Just got off work. That's good. I'm gonna get some shit. Jesus, give a damn schizo. That's a good thing to say. You know what the shit? What are you doing? Still out there chasing Nero. Playing follow the chopper. Yeah. No. He's not. He's he's looking into it. It takes right. time. Open it up. Just don't get your hopes up, brother. Out. Hey, Mrs. John. Where's Where Boozer? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? I thought he was with you. Yeah, he was, and then he he took off. Some shit. Excuse me. What the fuck are you telling me? Get off me! Look. He grabbed a bottle of whiskey, he said he was going home. I don't know. Motherfucker, and you didn't even try to stop him, did you? Hey! We tried! You gotta know when to cut a man loose. You gotta know when a man's done. something? Hey, how's it going? Mike's looking pretty busted. Okay. Ricky, you there? What's wrong? Boozer went out, and he didn't come back. Shit. You heading up there? Uh, need help? No, I'll find you. Uh, nice. Boozer, you there? Boozman! Uh, yeah, Deke. Yeah, Deke. Oh, I'm here. Where the hell are you? It's, it's getting dark out. Where? Wait a sec, I got it. I'm at the farm. I'm at the, f the farm. Jesus, stay there. I'm coming to get you. Just, just stay here. I got it. I got it. I got it. <laughs> Right, here's the farm. This is where Ricky said the work crew was. Boozer! You there? Boozman! Damn it! Okay, here's the farm. Hey, where's Boozer? Who? Ah, oh, there's no one here. Work crew's gone home for the day. No, he's still here. The, the big guy with one arm. Yeah, yeah, I know who you mean. He headed off that way, towards the old farmhouse. Thought he was getting a ride there. If you see him, tell him, tell him to stay here. Radio me or Ricky. Sure, man. Whatever.
Boozer! You there? Oh. Skinner said that he had a, a bottle of whiskey. <laughs> Where would he go to drink a bottle of whiskey? One of these uh, farmhouses? This has got to be it. Boozer! Are you in here? Yes, it looks like it. Good book to read. Well, whiskey bottle. Empty. Wait a second. Case of beer? Come on! Gotta take a closer look. Which way? <sighs> You're mine now. Beer bottle. Empty. Heading that way. Damn it. Schizo's right. He's heading home. Boozer! Booze man! Hey, Dick. <laughs> How's it going, brother? You said you were at the farm. I just left, and you are not at the farm, Boozer. Uh, wait, oh, oh, the other farm. I'm, um, I, I, I went to the other farm, you know, I, I found a sixer. <laughs> so, I thought I'd go for a walk, you know, like, this little walk at the sunset. So, uh, I just walked to, uh, the other farm, you know? Boozer, what are you doing? Okay, let's take a look around. Boozer, are you in here? Booze man. Upstairs. Okay, now what? Another bedroom. All right, what have we got? And another beer bottle. That's what I've ever I'm not gonna ask. Boozer, where are you? Booze! I, I thought you were gonna come um, have a beer with me and take a walk. Boozer, just... Where are you? Would you look around? Did you tell me what you see? What's nearby? Give me a, give me a landmark or something. I already told you. Oh, oh look at that shit. Look at what, Boozer? What do you see? The road. The road's uh, wow. It's just, it's gone. Like, like somebody came and just swept it away. The road's gone. Oh yeah. The, the like somebody. 
came and just swept it away. Gone. I'm walking. And walking. I'm, and, and now the road is just gone. Where, where are you going, Boozer? That's where I'm going. Just stay right there. Just stay where you are. Get down. Get out of sight. Listen for my bike. I'm coming. I'm not hiding from no one. I'm going home. Hey, home. What's that? Another beer bottle. This is it. Okay, let's see. What's going on here? Gotcha. That's gotta be him. There you are. Boot prints. Bingo. Boozer, you there? I'm getting close. I, uh, I followed your tracks. Just, you taught me. Uh, Boozer, come on, man. Stay put, will ya? For a stroll. Hey, Dig. How's it going, old buddy? Boozer, where are you going? Home. Oh, that's where I'm going, home. Oh, well, we can't go back to O'Leary Mountain. Oh, I'm not going to fucking O'Leary Mountain. I'm going to farewell. Shit, come on. We gotta get you to No. Doing. You wanna take a swing at me? Fine. Get in line behind them. Bring it! Okay. So this is it. This is where we're going out. Get out no, here, no, I don't think so. Huh, Boozer? Huh? Bro? Boozer? The nice year old lady was killed. What did I say to you? What did, you know? what did I say to you, huh? I found you halfway through a case of whiskey. You were gonna drink yourself to death. What did I say to you? You grabbed a bottle. And you chugged it. It was a lot of goddamn whiskey. And you told me that if I was gonna drink myself to death, you'd be right there with me. That's what brothers do. So like I said, Boozer... Is this it? This is how we're going out? Let's get the hell out of here. Go, go, go! I'm going! Go faster, then! of them. Yeah. We're gonna be okay. I, I knew. I knew it all along. Hey, hey, Pete. Boozer, listen. I just want to say thank you, man. I mean it. Boozer, uh, just listen, goddammit. You came out here and you saved my sorry ass. Again. I owe you, brother. I owe you. No, no, Boozer, I owe you... All right, look, if it weren't for you, I, uh, I would have been dead a long time ago. Or worse. I thought you said there was nothing worse than being dead. Yeah, 
Well, I was wrong. All right, open it up. He's okay. You gonna be okay? Oh, hell yeah. Oh, I hear a bunk calling my name. Yeah, Ricky, I found him. How is he? 